I couldn't resist. I had to get the new Growing Together expansion pack. I'm sure this will elevate our gameplay and possibly change our story a little bit. We have midlife crises, trait discoveries, there's social dynamics, a whole new compatibility system, family bonds. There are so many things to this. Infants, infant quirks new child ambitions and I'm so excited to just start playing and continue our story. So welcome back to The Sims 4 Star Sign Legacy Challenge Part 9 I believe. And we're on Generation 2. Don't bother looking for Generation 1 Aries because I played that off cam. There is, however, a recap video that you can watch, and there's some pictures, a, a walkthrough, uh, I don't even remember, the, the rules of the challenge I explain in that video. So it's, it can be useful to watch. If not, just hop along here. It's a perfect place to start because we're on the second generation and she's a young adult but now is when her life really starts because we've got her assigned career now and she's not really here yet with the children and family gameplay but we're just about to wrap up her young adulthood in the city and yeah I can't we have to play now. And we're in! Last time we met our co-workers for the first time, and now I'm so excited to see if we've had any kind of compatibility with them. Oh, let's look. Henry, we have... bad compatibility with. Based on their preferences, these sims have bad compatibility. Their affinity from the start won't be great, but it could certainly be worse. Well, it'll be a challenge for them to grow close. That doesn't necessarily mean it's not worth trying. Okay, so no feelings towards the other ones. Maybe it takes a while to develop, I don't know. Okay, so I also quickly just <laughs> kick the co-workers out of their respective families. They were still living at home. It was time. They're young adults. They should live in the city with us. So now hopefully we can ask them to be our roommates and they will accept and not say we already have a home because now they're technically homeless. Yeah, we'll see. First up, what time is it even? It's a Friday at 4 a.m. And we have work today in eight hours. We have already prepared enough food. Looks great. Looks like we're on for a promotion, possibly, if we work really well. That'll mean we're on level eight next. Anything new here? Oh my god, I forgot about the milestones! That's one of the key points. Uh, adopted a pet, adopted a pet, adopted a pet, adopted a pet. Technically, we didn't adopt Polka and Pita though. They were born into the family, and they were a surprise. Made a best friend, ended a romantic relationship. This is a good recap of her life, actually. We can view her milestones. So if you're new here, Here's the recap. She got a promotion and she had her first woohoo. She has adopted a pet. Okay, a few pets here. These two have sadly passed away and these two are still in the household. We have a culinary arts degree. She studied hard 
Yes. And she got a job from that degree. We can't go back. Okay, that's fine. So the chronological order of milestone time. First, life and social. Chronologically, it's basically the same for her. How could I even forget that? That's okay. Yeah, no, I'm just ah, okay. <laughs> it's so lame, but this is happiness. Okay, just let me have my moment. Um, yeah, sleep. That's what she needs. I can't even think straight. Okay, no, she doesn't need sleep. She needs to cook. That's so in character. It's unbelievable. I have a sneaky feeling though that she didn't wake up by herself. Um, she didn't wake up on her own. Hello, why are you running away from me? Pita, do we have to teach you some manners? Well, yeah. Lecture about waking up. But we're busy. Kitchen. Nom, nom. Ah, the club is still going. <laughs> okay. I, I'm pretty sure I ended the gathering last part. But that means they technically living here, no? Maybe we can ask them for real? How about you? Be our roommate! Okay, I didn't want you to cancel your cooking. Okay, ask Robbie here. Roommate? Question mark. I see you like hanging around here just 6am in the morning. Would you like to live here? Are you kidding me? No, you don't. What? I have others in the household that depends on me right now? That's a lie. You just don't want to live here. Because the other person in your household is him. Do I really have to split them up? Roommate, ask... What's your name? Patrick? Oh. Would you like to be my roommate? Okay, I'm ruining the relationship. Uh, yeah, no. Okay, they, they're dependent on each other and neither of them want to live here. Oh, now we can plan stayovers. Yeah, no, she said the same. Um, where was I? Something, something, roommate. Cancel roommate advertisement. Yeah. Okay, science, baby. Yeah, interesting. Eating vegetable chili for breakfast. Before work today, your dogs need you. And I Oh, yeah, we wanted to lecture you. I don't think we can do that anymore. But we can give you a bath, and I won't uh, force you to sit through that, because it's been a pain. If you know, you know. Give, no, no, please, no, nah, mm-mm, <laughs> give back. <laughs> um, it's been a struggle in the past, hopefully it goes smoothly now that we have our own bath. There we go. A nice luxury bath. These dogs are so incredibly spoiled. <laughs> But they're her babies. For now. <laughs> Just wait for infants. Also twin infants. That'll be chaotic. I'm terrified. And excited. You're not fully rested, so... Get that sorted. And then we'll check back in after work, hopefully with a promotion. That's our girl, promoted to sous chef. 
She will now make an additional 38 simoleons per hour. That's a nice salary. And she had a bonus and she received a, an ice box of steel. And she can now write a cookbook on the computer. Wow. She's level 8. That's insane. Oh, our mother is coming to visit. Her first time here. Invite her in. <laughs> I kind of want to check the mailbox, but I'm also terrified. Because you know what happened last time. The recent neighborhood stories. Alexander Goff has died. And... Oh, so many townies. What's up with that? That's another townie? Adopted a cat. Eliza is now a maker of... She's in the mechanical engineer career. Okay, good for her. And nothing else. Okay, phew. Why are you mad? Yeah, that's no one's surprise, actually. Go outside. Can you bake something? Oh, wait, I have an idea. Ta-da! Um, I got a little sidetracked. I mean, I had to look at a new cool, fun, new stuff. What? So now we have a little splash pad outside. And uh, I also set up shop down in the basement. No, not the basement. The, the, the like, garage. But what's a garage good for when you have no cars? So we have a cupcake machine that we have to try out. And our new... Uh, like a whole kitchen setup basically from just working this career um, rewards and then we have a little selling table because I think we can have a little bake sale with our cupcakes or pastries I didn't know you can make pastries here muffins donut holes oh there's a few different sorts to improve our baking skill let's oh we're cooking cupcakes I see and we're baking the other things the 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 what the baking cupcakes those require the highest skills so those are worth the most because don't look at our money situation right now it should be fine, money shouldn't be a concern, I mean, that salary, yeah, but we're also kind of saving up for a restaurant, so it doesn't hurt to gain a little more, and like I said, got a little carried away over here, but look how cute it is, and it's also a heat wave, so it's the perfect time to try it out. Okay, we're missing the cool part. Well... This is not a new item, by the way. This is from Get to Work. I'm pretty certain. So, this cupcake machine has been out for a while. I just rarely use it because it's huge. Those doesn't look that well. No, those are foul. Are you... what? Oh, so much is happening right now wait no wait no freak you just got promoted and now you have to go back into work um sorry you're exhausted you're exhausted and i'm excited i had different plans oh you're screwing this up okay i guess we'll have to send her to work again but first let's buy a sleeper pillow 
the sleep replacement from the reward store. We have so many points. Okay, sleep, yes. We're drinking sleep tonight. Going into work, that's insane. Honestly. But the culinary career is hard. No one said it was going to be easy. And this is kind of what it's like, isn't it? It's pretty realistic. The long hours. Yeah. Good thing you don't have a whole family to take care of. Where are you taking that? Oh, you're right. Our mother was here. I totally forgot. <laughs> Sorry, Amber. We'll have to hang out another time. Yeah, your dogs are not well behaved. Stop drinking from that. Where would you put that? You have to drink that. You ugly. Fida, no drinking from the puddle. Artica, drink the sleep replacement. You will feel way better. So I guess we'll have to do the yard sale thing another day another time. Head into work, we'll see you later. Uh oh. Oh no! Grim, why are you here? Didn't I tell you to stay away? Oh, no! Not Cupid! Oh! Now I feel responsible. She's not even here. She's not even home. I promise I've been taking care of her. I say as she's filthy as yeah, flies flying around her. I'm sorry, I have been taking care of her. Honestly, we should be grateful that she survived this long. Because technically she was older than Blitzen. She was already an adult dog when Blitzen was adopted. As a puppy. So it's, it's incredible. She's an old lady, and now we say goodbye to her. Um, Arctica is about to have a very bad day once she comes home. <sighs> goodbye, Cupid. Are you kidding me? My dog has a fear of death. That's Cupid's son, by the way, if you couldn't tell. Um, what is that even possible? No, no, they're incredible. They're all depressed dogs. I'm not ready for this. This must be a new feature. Hey, we heard what happened. I'm so sorry you're going through such a tough time. If you'd like some company, we wouldn't mind staying over for a few days to keep you company. Oh, we, who do you mean? Yourself, all the whole family? But we have space now, so sure, feel free to come over. Thank you. Yep, she knows. And she's in mourning. Oh, I'm sorry. But your your family's coming to cheer you up. Look! Suitcase and all! Lucia is here first. Her younger adopted little sister. Stay over guest. Yep, welcome them. What are you off to do? Ooh, you like this, huh? Bye bye! <laughs> Are those better quality? Then you have something to serve to your guests. Yeah, they're excellent. Some strawberry fizzy cupcakes. Fizzy? How on earth are cupcakes fizzy? Am I missing out on something here? Oh, did you see? Mm hmm. They're acting out. Yep. Yeah. Playing in the trash. 
Oh, that's, um, let's, yeah, put you over there. The dog is sound asleep on the couch right next to, no, that's too sad. That's too sad. More suitcases. Yeah, looks like it's the whole family. All three of them. Hi. Welcome. They're sad too. Oh, yeah, to be fair, it was the family dog. She's been around for a while. So welcome them all. Hi, Mom. This is the heiress sim. No, 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 no. Don't taste those. You want those. Those are not dog friendly. Oh. Okay, can, like, do you assign beds yourselves? This is our bed. Yeah. Okay. Jack is taking the single bed. Who's getting the master suites? Amber and Lucia. <laughs> of course, the girlies. Yeah. So, no need for roommates then. Where are you off to? What are you doing? Hello, are you okay? You don't look okay. Your whole family is here and you're choosing to sit outside on a bench in the rain. Mood. Do you need help with those suitcases? Wait, this isn't a suitcase? What am I? This, this is a backpack? A smaller suitcase? Oh, that's a nice attention to detail. Okay, so that was Lucia's. Let's get that up. Way up. Into her room. That was Jack. He's such a gentleman, claiming the smallest room. And Ember. Welcome home, guys. It's 6 a.m. Your sleep schedule is about to be so messed up because of your work hours. That's madness. And um, yeah, the, the, the same thing would be to go to bed, honestly. Just cry it out and go to bed. Oh no! Fear of death, Peta is now running away! Come back! No! Oh no. I'm sorry. <laughs> you will make his way home eventually, but posting an alert can help find him sooner. Oh, she's about to be so sad again. Cause this is a new item as well. We have symbols. Okay, and we can change it to card, don't make a long one, those are old. And puzzles, that's the one I'm excited to try. Can we do it together with our family? Play symbols with. We'll see. Choose a puzzle. A puzzle from reference, 100 pieces. You're beginners, so let's try the 50 pieces one. Animals. Best friends forever. That sounds like a dog theme. Anyone want to play with us? Can we ask them to join? Ask to relax. It's, yeah, she's joining. How about you? Too old for puzzles? Or not old enough? 
Yeah, he's he's joining family time. What are you making? Can we tell already? I see some paws and some cat ears. You're kind of in the way here, Ember. It's a cat and a dog, of course. Cute, and you're excited. Yeah. Now you have to post an alert before I forget. Not that I for would forget our dogs, but yeah. Um, how do I do that? Post alert about missing pets. Can we do anything about the puzzle? We can frame it. Cute! And give it to our future child. Oh, that would be so sweet. That should help Arctic Arins. Alert should have everyone looking for PETA. And while PETA is gone, we really have to take care of the polka so he doesn't run away as well. The puzzle is complete. Oh, it's a, it's a large puzzle. Sweet! I like that. That's so sweet. What else? We haven't even hung our diploma. Ah, we'll keep that for our future home. Because this is not the permanent solution. This is just... I think while she is completing this career, and then we'll move to start a new restaurant and all of that. There's so many exciting things left. Ah, someone's annoying the splash pad. Can this be a way to be? No. Nope. Yeah. Never mind. I thought this was the life hack of the century, having the dogs play in the splash pad to be cleaned or washed. Seek solace. <laughs> no, not me. Give that. Are you gonna walk around in your PJs all day? No, you can't actually, because you have work in seven hours. It, it'll take some time to adjust to this new schedule. Let's go! This is a great angle. Yeah. Back at it again. With the bubbles. Can you stay clean this time? Please. <laughs> Don't go rolling around in puddles or mud or play in the trash. None of that. Okay? Okay, deal. Oh, good luck! Peter has returned home. And, oh. Look at this! Oh my god, things are looking up. Okay. Her career performance is excellent, so she might possibly be coming home with another promotion. But most importantly, Peter is back home. Yeah, welcome home, guy. Good to see you. Can welcome him back, but we have to come back home first. Let's speed this up. Have I been playing for like forever, or was that a very fast promotion? She's just that good at her job. Are you coming back home or what? She's staying late. She's such an overachiever, but wow, a new outfit. Wait, let me see you. Where are you at? <gasps> Not uh, eyes. She's now the executive chef. She will make an additional 169 smaller an hour. 
Okay, but what happened there? I don't know. Yeah, that seems about right. Where was I? She received a bonus, some more simoleons. She's on level mm, second to last level. Congratulations to Arctic Green. She is now the master of the kitchen. Yelling at underling, uh, at what? At un, uh, underlings? Never heard that before, but okay. Demanding things be recooked. Screaming at underlings. Reprimanding underlings. It's all possible now. That sounds like our Taurus chef. Yep. She has to max the cooking skill and reach level 8 of the gourmet cooking. We are currently. We're so close to maxing it. That's madness. What? 98% complete. And gourmet cooking is level 6, about to turn over to level 7. And I think that's all for today. Honestly, she's accomplished so much. It was so much fun looking at the new features of this pack and I can't wait to play more. I really don't want to stop right now, but yeah, I have to edit this too. So <laughs> thank you so much for watching and take care.